All right, so here we're still on the 605N. Um, this is the net wrap system. This is the electric actuator. It's a linear actuator, so it's just an electric motor right here, and it's gonna have a gearbox. Sometimes they're a chain drive, most of the time they're a, a gear transmission in here, just for reduction, um, for more torque. And then it looks like a hydraulic cylinder, but they're using a, a stainless steel or a chrome shaft just for to resist rust. So, um, but that's just going to extend out. So right now we are in the home position. It's fully extended. Um, if we come around here, when we go to load our net wrap, we actually take this off, slip our roll on over here, and put this back on, and that's literally just kind of just going to ride along there. Um, we got our extra net wrap storage, we got our, our feed pan, our one idler roller. Basically all it's going to be doing is spinning, much like this, trying to extend that net wrap out as we're, as we're spinning to keep it nice and wide so we're applying it on the bale correctly. Um, here we'll just sit there, if you crank this up, you can see that's going to expand. Okay. So when we go to actually load, you're just going to simply back it off whatnot around here we have our spring tension okay so i cannot turn very easily that drum so if i come and i lift this brake pad off right there okay that's going to be our tension the other thing with our brake pad right here is when we have it off if you guys look at this light on this sensor, that's a pretty neat little check. Um, as it goes past, our holes are what's actually going to what it's going to be counting against. So it's going to have four uh, four counts per revolution. Um, so they're going to be counting their rolls like that. Um, as you do that, it's sitting there flashing. That's telling you that it actually is sensing correctly. It is working. So. Um, when we go to extend it here, it'll it'll extend to apply the net wrap in. Go ahead. Okay, our feed pan is going forward. As you can see, go ahead and pause. So now our feed pan is fully into our belts. Okay, so the only thing that's going to be between this pan and our belts right here is that net wrap. So that's going to engage it. It's going to drop down onto our delivery rack, and that's going to wrap around the front of the end of the bale and actually start applying. Okay, go ahead and also the other thing is our brake is loose. So we want it to go in there. Okay, we come back. Okay, go ahead and pause. So right here, we have our brake is applied, so we're now stretching that net wrap tight. Uh, we're going over top this feed pan yet, but we have our knife ready to go down and cut it. Okay, go ahead and go home. All the way, cut. So let it apply it again. Now it's coming back. Go ahead and clear that code. And there it goes to cut. So that's basically how that system works. Um, the deer, the uh, the Massey is very similar to this where it's a rear mounted, the, the New Holland in the case is completely different where it's a front mounted, um, where it's a front mounted net wrap. So you look on here, here is your net loading position. Okay, so our, load, our roll is gonna sit here, it's gonna come off the back side like this, gonna go underneath this roller atop our feed pan and into the belts. Okay, so if we were to look at that, we're gonna put our roll on this shaft right here. We're gonna pull off. We're gonna come around the bottom of this pan or this bar right here, come around the top, over top, and lay right on top there. So that's basically the, the gist of how that's gonna work. So.